Hey, my name is Sean Sawyer, and I'm very excited to be one of your judges this week. I've done this before, and I'm very excited to do it again. So let's get to it. And I had fun watching all of your videos. I am an artist myself, as you can see. Um, I'm in my studio right now, and that's where I watch all of your videos. And it was very inspiring. I like it. Um, anytime you can take art and put it into uh, your own creativity on the ice and on music and with the movement, with your, um, with the position of the body and how you express yourself and all the highlights and lowlights of the music. I had a lot of fun. I watched the videos uh, more than once uh, for my own personal pleasure. Um, it was great. So let's get to it. So first was Danielle. You're not renting, girl. You're owning. Loved it. Loved the musicality, the freedom. I would have liked a little bit more of eye contact. Don't be scared. Like, just stare us down. Do it. <laughs> um, it was all about love and romance. I love all of the stags. I just wish there was more extensions in the stags. But I liked it. Um, 4.5 stars. Good job, Danielle. Loved it. Uh, then we're off to Kyle. Um, it was like as if she was your muse and you were um, getting energy off of her. I love the beginning, the middle, and the end. There was a little bit of lack of what was happening in between those moments. Because those moments were so strong that whenever it wasn't as strong, um, I was I was let down a little bit by it. I just wish you would have kept that feeling going. And I did like the connection you had with your partner. I just wish it was a stronger connection and maybe a little bit um, rough or it was... Um, it was just lacking just a little bit, okay? But I like when things are exaggerated. So, uh, 3.5 stars. I know you can do better than that. Uh, Stephanie. First of all, I love all of the levels that you use. Um, Adam Blight. Hi. <laughs> Um, he was great. Uh, I really like the low, the middle, the up, uh, the toe work. Um, I thought that it was very original. It was new. Uh, that's what graffiti is. It's a little bit pop art. It's supposed to um, make you question. Is that really art? Well, yes, it is. And that's what that piece was all about. It was uh, pushing the boundaries, pushing the envelope. I liked all the tricks. They were placed perfectly on the music. I was very clever. And I, I like when people experience, uh, I call it popping the bubble. It's a little bit you're in your own bubble and you say, screw it, I'm going to pop it. And <laughs> I'm just going to explore what's um, outside of it. And it, it was perfect. I loved it. Five stars. Five. It was amazing. Good job, Stephanie. Um, Morris. Finesse. I wrote down finesse with a big smile. So, <laughs> it, it like everything was put at the right place. Extensions were there. Toes were pointed. Shoulders were down. It was really nice. Everything was really well linked together. Uh, the only thing is that there was a lot of um, repetition, which is okay. Uh, repetition is okay, especially in um, a subject like we have here, art, that um, if you repeat the same thing on a different note of music or different way, different direction, it can all work. But the only thing is that there was a lot of same rotation, same way. Um, I like the buildup. For the beginning. And then I was expecting something bigger out of that build-up. But it was there. Maybe it's just my own expectations. Um, I love the piece, though. It, I give it four stars. Good job. 
Laura, I'm hooked and obsessed. Watched it various times. Um, um, artists are very unorthodox and bizarre and they own it and they're sort of in their own little creative world. They don't even know they're in their own world, but um, I, <laughs> uh, I, I kind of feel like that uh, most, most of the time and I'm sure people look at me in a weird way when I'm walking down the street or and I'm thinking about uh, music and movement and I just let free and that's what I got from from this piece I really liked it I liked the freedom I liked that it was all about how an, an artist feels and views the world and views movement and I adored it four stars Cordero it was like a scenery, a scenery. Uh, I got the feeling that it was like a formation of a unique snowflake. It's as if like Mother Nature goes through so much to make something that probably nobody's gonna view under a microscope. And you sort of question yourself, why is she putting herself through so much? <laughs> well. It, it was fantastic. I really loved it. I give you five stars. Like the shapes, um, the, the musicality. I, I liked it. Like I just wanted to skate in that piece. I wanted to strap my skates on and just hop on that ice with you guys. It was really amazing. Loved it. Now, Arthur. Power positions prestige power ranger <laughs> it was um i i looked loved how you took the statues which are like really strong and you were able to get those movement on the ice and then transform to a skater but keep that persona of i am a statue i'm strong really adored it nice triple toe um your dedication it kept us really interesting, uh, interested. Um, really liked the piece. Uh, I think it suited you very well. I like the different levels as well uh, in the piece. Um, give you four stars. So that's it for now. I think we have one more video that we're waiting for for Darren. Um, I'll make a video when I get your video. So thank you very much for having me as a judge. I adore this competition. I think it's a great thing for figure skating. Love you all. Your work is fantastic.